Hi Amanda Armstrong, welcome to the back of this weird thing here. Don't know what this is. Parallel Serial PS2. Parallel Serial PS2. What? 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 Parallel Serial PS2. And this has come from a UK address uh, from Basildon. So it's really. Oh, excuse the beeps. The beeps of doom. Um, parallel Serial PS2. What the heck is that? That doesn't look like a Parallel Serial PS2. That looks like a um, some sort of voltmeter. 5 to 30 volts. Um, yeah. Yeah. I, what? Two wires. Okay. Don't know what this is. But let's, uh, it has a rating on it. Let's put some power in it and see what that is. That's weird. I don't know if somebody's just sent this to me. There's no note. Or if it's just a mistake. 2.5 to 30 volts. So, okay, we're at 3 volts now on our bench power supply. Do, 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 do. Ready, steady, go. Okay, I can see a very dim, super dim. 3.1 and it gets brighter it gets brighter and you need it kind of looks like it wants the 3.5 so I've got 8.9 um, reading I'm reading from my bench power supply you see and we're just comparing so I'm gonna put up it's 14 point5 15.9 18.6 21 24 28.3 mmm uh, just over 30. In fact, it 31. Yeah, so it does. It does sort of cock out. Um, okay. I don't know who whoever sent it to me. Great, that's wonderful. But please leave a note so I know um, who it's from. I'm really super confused. It's it's super awesome actually. It's probably uh, more valuable than a, a serial to. What did it say? Parallel Serial PS2. I don't even know what this could have been, um, but yeah, this is pretty awesome. I'm uh, I'm really I'm really quite liking that. That um, is quite nice because it's a sort of self-contained voltmeter and it doesn't have any other additional wires. It's just the two wires, so it's getting its reference and its uh, power at the same time. And the reason it can work that's because basically a lot of these ICs, like thus, when it focuses. Um, run as low as 1.8 volts anyway yeah and the it's probably got a power regulator here to act as a reference voltage so it's probably providing a reference voltage anyway so it's got say it's what well, say it's 1.8 volts so it's measuring the input voltage against the 1.8 and that's what you're seeing on the screen the reason it's running dim though is because those LEDs are going to require a minimum amount of voltage and current and unless your power supply is putting out at least that minimum it's not going to be able to make them bright enough. But once it got to a certain brightness, you saw it didn't get any brighter because then it's being clamped again by regulation. Possibly this, same regulator. And there's a trimmer there to adjust it. So it's obviously been factory adjusted. And there's, you can see, 25 volts right there. You can see the different values of resistor. Maybe some sort of potential divider. Without buzzing out the circuit, you're not going to know. But you can see here, plus, minus, and then there's like an asterisk. So maybe this was in a, another design. They're probably reusing that, so that could be an external reference voltage, and this could be a 5 volt module on that one, or it could be for a tachograph, it could be for current. They use these for all sorts of things temperature probe, they're all probably coming in on the analog part of the actual uh, microcontroller. But yeah, that's quite cute in a very blue kind of way. But yeah, I'm kind of annoyed now because somebody's made some work for me because I've got to go and see if it's something I ordered and they cocked up the order. But yeah, as ever, thanks for watching.